welcome back to the vlog y'all it's a new day yeah i feel like every time i come on the vlog i am in the freaking car like what is going on like every time i get on the vlog introduce the vlog y'all i'm in the car um but what's going on y'all what is up what is up what is up so um y'all today oh y'all it is 3 p.m and i am um i'm going to pick up mimi in a little bit from school but y'all i just kind of want to come and introduce the vlog and just kind of vent or whatever but let me and i'm gonna get to that in a minute but yeah today i went to the gym i um got some work done i recorded a video today so that should be up in that should be up before this vlog so y'all probably already seen it so if you have just don't even mind what i'm saying but um i recorded a story time today so if y'all haven't already definitely go ahead and check that out or if you haven't even seen the video yet if i haven't posted it yet then it's coming after this vlog so yep anyway y'all so today i'm doing good um i feel good yeah i need to go get a new ponytail because this is it's it's definitely time for a new one but anyway y'all i just kind of want to come in a little bit so y'all y'all so lately i have been lately i have been talking to this guy y'all and he cool you know we've been talking for like a month now like he mad cool he's nice he's a gentleman like he keep himself up like he's clean cut like he dressed well like he got money like he about his money like he's consistent with me like texting talking on the phone and stuff like that um you know uh seeing me like us hanging out and stuff like that like he's very consistent and that's why i look for when i am looking for a guy looking for a man so um that's like the number one thing right there like you being consistent and you being about your money and he's about his money y'all so we're gonna call him mr collector only because y'all he be collecting um he be collecting shoes like he's a shoe head like jordan's nikes like all that like he's a big time shoe head i ain't gonna say his name on here i'm not really gonna give too much like information about him but we're gonna call him mr collector so if i ever come back on on uh if i ever come back on camera talking about him then y'all know who i'm talking about but we're gonna call him mr collector y'all because he be collecting shoes so um anyway y'all so we've been talking you know everything been good everything been you know you know everything been good you know he telling me he feeling me he liking me you know with the wool whatever you know i'm feeling him too or like that but i'm not about to just rush into anything you know so like he's single y'all like he's older than me he's 30 i'm 28 um he don't have no kids so you know everything good right so y'all so every day we texting like we texting all day long like we be texting like he be yeah why he be getting his bag like we be texting like we be like on the phone like all day talking right well not like all day but she most of the damn day we be talking y'all like we be we be literally like on the phone like we be communicating like we be doing our thing right so y'all we had a date right we had a date plan for um we had a date plan for a couple of days ago right so one day y'all we just texting or whatever like that and he asked me something and i replied then he said what you up to or something like that and so i replied back to him y'all he never responded back right he never he never responded back to me so i'm like okay what's going on so i'm like okay you know i didn't even worry about texting him like the rest of the day you know because this was like evening time like we had been texting the whole day and then like when he said that and i replied this was like maybe like five something so i'm like oh, maybe he driving maybe he doing something like you know i don't know maybe he doing something he hit me up later or whatever right so cool y'all so the next day come i don't hear nothing from him usually like he sent me a good morning text message like or he'll call me you know like i ain't hear nothing so i'm like okay so i text him like hey what's up you know yeah i never got a reply back so i'm like hmm i'm like okay i'm like okay cool like because you know like yeah i can't trip because he ain't my man like that ain't my nigga like i can't 
I can't trip about nothing he do. He can't trip about nothing I do. Like, cause we not like official. And then like they like, yeah, we getting to know each other. You know, we going on dates and shit. Like, we doing this, we doing that. Whatever well, like that. Now we ain't, we ain't been sexual. Nothing like that, y'all. We ain't kiss yet. So, um, he's like very, he's very, very respectful. Like he is very respectful. Like he ain't, he ain't trying to come on me too hard. Like he ain't trying to do none of that. Like he's very respectful. I can definitely say that about him. But anyway, y'all, so, um, uh, what was I saying? So, so the next day, like, he texts me, so I, I text him, and I ain't getting no reply. So I'm like, okay, cool, like, whatever, like, I'm not tripping, like, you know, whatever, like, you know, whatever. So the next day come, after that day, I don't hear nothing from him. I don't hear nothing. So I'm like, okay, like, damn, maybe he don't want to fuck with me. Like, damn, what I do? Like, maybe he don't want to fuck with me. With the, with the, so I call, y'all, his phone rings two times. And then it goes straight to voicemail. So I'm like, okay, like, did he hang up on me? He got me blocked. He on the other line. Like, what's going on? Like, like, what's the issue? Like, what's the problem? Like, what I do to you? Like, you know, just be honest with me. Like, if you fucking, like, if you're not interested or you, or you got something else going on, like, damn, you could just say that. Like, we grown. Like, it's 2020. It's 2021. Like, keep it real. Like, keep it real, real. So, so I'm like, okay, cool. So, all right cool like i don't hear from him but it's like it's weird because like every y'all every day me and mr collector be talking like we be talking every freaking day like we be talking like y'all we be on that phone like we be texting like we be talking we be having good conversation like we don't be having like no job i hate a nigga who be hubby texting dry shit like dude like talk like have a conversation like tell me about yourself like ask me questions like i hate a man who be be talking about dry shit like give me that communication like that's why we texting that's why we on the phone like communicate like i hate that about a man but he actually give me communication and i love it so i'm like okay cool like okay you know what's really going on so i'm thinking like damn is he hurt is he in the hospital like y'all start thinking the worst like what's going on and i start thinking like damn he do he not want to fuck with me like what did i do you know what the what the what, whatever okay y'all so i'm back i know the video cut off y'all i ended up getting a phone call i had to take that phone call so y'all now i'm back at home don't even worry about all this stuff right here y'all I'm separating this stuff. I'm looking through it and stuff, y'all. So don't even worry about that. Focus on me, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and get back to this little vent rent situation thing I was telling y'all um, in the car. So yeah, so um, when I actually just now look back on the footage, I realized I didn't tell y'all about the date. So, so I'm gonna kind of just recap about the whole situation, so yeah. Okay, so like I was saying, one day we was texting and he asked me something and I think he asked me uh, what you up to and I replied back to him and he didn't reply back to me, basically. So actually that next day, the next day we, we had a date plan and we were supposed to go out to eat just for some lunch or whatever because you know he was off, he was chilling for the day. He wanted to take me to go get something to eat um, early in the day because I had some other things to go do later on in the day. So um, we were just going to go and get some food and just, you know, talk, have a good conversation, eat, you know, have some good lunch, you know. So uh, anyway, so the next day came, the day of our date came and y'all, he didn't hit me up. He didn't, or nothing. So I ended up texting him. When I texted him, he did not respond back. So... I'm like, okay, cool, whatever. I'm not tripping because you ain't my man already. So I'm not your woman. We just getting to know each other or whatever like that. So everything, you know, okay, whatever. You know, he hit me when he hit me, basically. So the next day came, y'all. So I called his phone, like I already explained to y'all. I called his phone in around two times. That was eating with the voicemail, whatever. So I'm like, okay, well, whatever. Maybe he not feeling me or maybe something else is going on. Maybe something serious happened, like... You know, I don't know, like, maybe something went down, like, or whatever, like, if he hit me, he gonna hit me, but at the same time, I'm not tripping like that, because he ain't my man. He's not my man, so I'm not even about to be tripping on nothing, okay? So, um, so yeah, y'all, so that happened. 
So then y'all today, so it's been like four days that I have not heard from Mr. Collector, okay? So today, y'all, he hit me up. He was like, um, hey, what's up? What you up to? How you been? I'm sorry, my phone haven't been working. I had to go get me a new phone. You know, blah, 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 basically. So in my head, I'm just like, you know, okay, like, should I believe it or should I not believe it? Like, which one, which one, which one? Like, you know, like, I don't know. Like, I don't, that's kind of like why I'm being to y'all because it's like, I don't know. Cause like, I don't have time to be playing games with me. Like, I don't have time for the like, baby, I'm getting older, I'm not getting younger, okay? So I don't have time to keep like playing games and shit with these men. Like I ain't got time for it. And it's the crazy part about it is like he can't be telling the truth. Maybe he is because it's like he been he been real. Like he been a one. Like he been like he been on his shit. Like with me. Like he been like he been hitting every point. Like he been hitting every level. Like Mr. Collector been doing his thing. Okay. So it's like damn. All of a sudden like. We hit this by like damn four days, like four days, like you've been without your phone for four days, like really? That's what it is. So it's like y'all like comment below, like help your girl out, like what do y'all think? Like do y'all think he bullshit or do y'all think he's serious? Like what y'all think from this situation? Cause like y'all, I don't know, like. Yeah, like he been texting me like since earlier. Like he been he been texting me like ain't shit happened. Like like he he texting me. He talking to me like how he was doing before. Like everything good. So I'm just like like should I believe what he's saying or should I not? Because it's like damn. Like I was saying we get ready to go on a date and you your phone ain't working. Like. You have phone problems, like what is it? You know, so I'm just like I don't know, but y'all comment down below and let, let me know what y'all think about Mr. Collector because like, he texts my phone like ain't nothing happening now. Like he he texts my phone like he talking he miss me and this and that, this and that. Like now nah, he ain't saying nothing about no um no date. Like let's redo a date. Like he ain't saying nothing about that, but. He told me so he missed me and yeah he apologized two times already so i'm just like i don't know like i don't know what to believe and it's like i don't want to be wasting my motherfucking time because i be getting to know somebody else like <laughs> like it's plenty of fish to see like i don't i don't have time to be wasting time basically like i ain't got time for like it's a billion and one man the who gon' want me, who gon' do right by me, who gon' do this, do that, do this, do that, make me feel like this, make me feel like that. Like, I don't have time to be wasting time on one, okay? So, it's like, mm, should, I, should I continue giving him a shot, y'all, or should I just throw him in the trash? What should I do? Comment down below and hit me y'all, but of course I will give y'all an update on Mr. Collector because y'all, he's still texting my phone. So, we gon' see, like, we gon' see, like, I feel like I'm willing to give him a chance because like maybe he maybe he was telling the truth. I don't know, but I don't know. Like I'm willing to give him a chance, but I feel like if some shit like that happened again, like I gotta cut you off. Like this see, like you gotta go, you gotta go in the trash can. In the trash can, I'm gonna get a garbage bag. I'm gonna put you in the trash can. I'm gonna go throw you out. Like. Yeah, if it happens again, but I feel like I'm gonna give him a chance. But I want to know y'all opinions, so y'all comment down below and let me know. But anyway, y'all, I am just chilling. I'm back in the house. Um, yeah, I'm not really doing nothing. Y'all see, I got this little new setup. I got my ring light, so y'all is actually sitting on my ring light, and I feel like it's better because y'all are not sitting low. Y'all are sitting high, and then y'all can see me. So I like it and. So I feel like it's giving what it needs to give and I feel like, yeah, like I look good. Like I feel like it's giving me the right lighting and yeah, so when I do my sit down videos, this is how it's gonna look. And also y'all, I'm about to go order me a disc because I want to start doing, um, I want to start doing, what am I thinking about, what am I thinking about, what am I thinking about? I want to start doing like, um, 
oh yeah my mind is gone somewhere else my mind focus on him y'all i want to i want to go give me a dance because i want to start doing hair tutorial videos i want to start doing that i want to try to get into makeup like i don't really wear makeup like that but i kind of want to start doing get ready with me and I want to do chit chat videos with y'all while doing my makeup. I want to be doing chit chat videos while doing my hair. I could be giving y'all story times. Like I just want to be able to do all that stuff, y'all. So I'm actually searching right now for me a desk. That way I can sit down at my desk and I can edit my videos. I can work. But also I can turn it into like a little vanity. Um y'all the vanities the makeup vanities that i have seen they are like super small and i do not want a small i want i do not want a small one i want an actual desk that's what i want y'all i want an actual desk where i have room where i can have my laptop i can actually work get some work done that way i'm not editing on my couch i'm not editing in my bedroom like i can sit down at my desk and i can get some work done and also i can just go buy me a big mirror and kind of like attach it to my um my desk when i'm ready to do my um my hair videos and like makeup videos or just story time chit chat with y'all like i can just set up my mirror onto my desk like that so y'all um that's actually what i'm looking into and i have one ring right now but i'm gonna go and give me another one just to give me that extra brightness and I'm also gonna get um, like some box lights and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and order those as well, y'all. I'm just trying to upgrade the YouTube channel. I'm trying to upgrade it. Like I'm trying to give y'all the best content that I can give y'all. And I want my videos to be clear. That way y'all can see me. It's not looking blurry and stuff like that. And yeah, I just wanna bring y'all some good ass content, period okay so um yeah i'm looking to give me a desk y'all i really want a glass desk but y'all i am so scared because when they deliver their glasses i'm scared that this is gonna be broken into pieces like i am scared of this so what i'm thinking about is like going to a furniture store ordering me a desk from the furniture store that way I know that it's wrapped up nicely. The people gonna bring it in my house. They gonna put it together like, <laughs> they gonna take care of it and instead of me ordering it from Wayfair or from Amazon and I get my shit, my shit broke. Like, I'm gonna be pissed, okay? So I'm thinking about just going to a furniture store. Y'all, I might be doing it this weekend. I might be doing it this weekend and I might just vlogging for y'all because I really wanna go ahead and give me a desk. So that um, I can sit there, I can edit, I can work, I can you know, do my videos. Like I can, I can really like come through how I want to come through. So um, I'm thinking about doing that, but you know, just taking everything step by step. I got my nice ring light, y'all. It's a touch screen ring light, so I love that, and it's cute and it's giving what it needs to give. So yeah, y'all, um, I definitely, I definitely needed to upgrade my lighting because. Yeah, my house is so dark like it's dark so and i have yellow lighting in the light bulb so yeah i needed this clear so yeah y'all so um yeah i'm just really looking into getting me a desk and yeah y'all so right now i'm actually about to help my baby with her homework so we can get that done i'm about to feed her some dinner and get her uh together so she can go to bed and yeah y'all i'm not sure if i'm even gonna come back on the vlog tonight i'll probably go pick y'all up tomorrow that dog is at the fucking i hope y'all don't hear it but um yeah y'all so i'm just gonna go ahead and end the vlog off right here for today and y'all know i'm gonna pick y'all up tomorrow so bye girl hey y'all welcome back to the vlog if you're new here welcome girl how you doing what's going on welcome to bunny's life make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and make sure you follow me on instagram it will be linked down below but hey girl if you're a returning subscriber hey girl hey welcome back to the vlog y'all welcome back to the channel what's going on y'all what's up how are y'all doing today y'all it is a new day y'all hear that it's thundering so i'm guessing it's about to rain and i'm about to go run errands wow 
anyway y'all it's 1 40 it's 1 43 p.m y'all and whew, child it's 95 degrees outside but um yeah y'all i'm just coming to introduce the vlog so what's up what's going on y'all so um i know i didn't update y'all on my last vlog about the whole vaccine and how i'm feeling and how i'm and how i'm doing everything so i'm going ahead i'm gonna go ahead and give you guys those details so i went and got my vaccine okay um after i got the vaccine i was fine y'all and then maybe like an hour after i got my vaccine my arm started to hurt i got my shot in this arm it started to hurt um just a little bit um i have a high pain tolerance so um but it was hurting just a little bit just a little bit um but y'all i haven't been feeling like sick or anything like that my energy is still good um but that was the only issue i had just a little pain in my arm where she gave me the shot at okay it's about to start raining okay um so yeah it was hurting when she gave me the shot but i mean that lasted like until the next day and didn't stop so yeah y'all um so yeah i got my vaccine so yeah um i am about to go and get a p.o box because a lot of y'all have been in my dms about sending me stuff and you guys want to promote your small businesses and i'm all for it i'm all for it so i'm gonna go and give me a p.o box so that you guys can send me um items from you all uh, businesses and if you just want to send me something or you want to send my daughter mimi something then you guys can also i'm gonna get a p.o box just because i have brands that are reaching out to me that want to work with me and they want to send me items so i don't want I don't want those companies sending items to my home so i'd rather me go get a p.o box and that way it's easy for me i can go pick up my stuff and also so i can do p.o box opening time with you guys on my channel so i really want to do that so if you all have businesses and you want to send me something to promote on my channel it's free all you have to do is just send me the items and i go pick them up from my p.o box and i will come on the channel and p.o box open those items with all of my subscribers so definitely go ahead and um send me those items i will have my p.o box information linked down below in the description also i will be um putting that information in my instagram bio as well so that you guys always know where it is and you guys can always see it um so that you guys can always see that um information so yeah yeah i'm gonna go do that so that hopefully i can and go ahead and pay for it and go ahead and uh yeah i don't want him to block me in sorry y'all so i can go ahead and pay for that and just you know get that done because i feel like now it is the time so um yeah i can go ahead and do p.o box opening time with you guys on the channel so yeah y'all i'm gonna go do that i need to go to the bank because i need to get some <laughs> i need to get some money girl i need to get some money i need to get some money i need some cash in my hand okay so i'm gonna go to the bank and then gonna go pick up Mimi and then I don't know what else holds for the day y'all because it's already 146 so yeah y'all my tongue is blue I am drinking a cold power a also y'all a while ago maybe like a month ago I actually bought the power A's that come in the case like the Gatorade case and I got the diet kind well the zero sugar kind and y'all that was so nasty i would never buy that power a again it was a zero sugar one and y'all it was so disgusting i would never purchase it again but y'all today i just got the regular one but y'all that zero calorie zero sugar ew it, it's disgusting it tastes like medicine so i would never buy that again um but yeah i just want to tell y'all that that's why my tongue is uh blue if y'all see it but um anyway so yeah i'm gonna do that y'all also i'm gonna be doing a vlog another vlog basically preparing for mimi's birthday mimi is about to turn six on september 10th so i want to go ahead and do a 
um prepare with me vlog for Mimi's birthday I'm gonna do that and I'm also gonna vlog her birthday um I had planned for Mimi to be going to Walt Disney World um for her birthday but as school time got closer and y'all I actually paid for everything the flights the hotel um the Disney World tickets I, I paid for everything y'all but as time got closer to school I realized what day Mimi birthday was on and I also realized that she would have to be taken out of school so what I did was I don't want my baby to miss school like that and she would have to miss a few days of school because we were going to be out there like a couple of days y'all we were going to be out there for her birthday we was going to be out there like two days before then we was going to be out there for the weekend because we wanted to explore all of the parks so y'all what i ended up doing because i don't want to keep her out of school like that so what i ended up doing was i decided to do was i canceled everything and i moved everything to a different date so basically when kids go on spring break y'all know that kids get a week off for of spring break so that is perfect because she's gonna get a week off from school i don't have to worry about her missing school as well as it's gonna be hot it's spring break time and it just give us enough time to have a good time out there at Walt Disney World so I just figured you know what that's the perfect time we don't have to rush to get back we don't have to rush to get there we don't have to rush to do anything because baby girl will have a whole week uh a whole week off from school so that is like perfect so basically I moved everything over to a different date and it was perfectly fine so yeah y'all we will be going to Disney World in March for spring break so um basically for her birthday she won't be doing Walt Disney World I'm gonna take her to I asked her did she want to go to Andretti or if she wanted to go to main event now i never been to andretti i want to go to andretti but she doesn't want to go to andretti probably because she never been and she don't really know what they have or understand really what that is so she kept saying that she wants to go to main event main event main event she has been to main event several times but you know what this is her birthday so whatever she wants to do i will let her do it so she wants to go to main event as well as she wants to go to papa Do's. y'all she love papa Do's. i don't know why but she loves Papa Doe, so she's going to go to um, main event for her birthday. Now, yeah, I did a big birthday party last year for Mimi at It's. I invited a lot of people, y'all, and people did not show up. So, I'm not going to do that. I'm not about to spend money like I did. Y'all, last year, I spent about $1,200 just on the party, on balloons, on her cake, on her gifts, on her outfit, um, her getting her hair done. Y'all, I spent a lot of money last year as well as i needed i needed to go and find me an outfit i had to get my nails and my feet done so i forget i spent a good about twelve hundred dollars so and nobody showed up um i had party gift bags i had candy i had you know i just had a lot of stuff and nobody really showed up so i told myself that i was never gonna do that again for her um it kind of hurt her feelings a little bit and it definitely hurt my feelings because I spent a lot of money um, on a birthday party for her and people did not show up and I really didn't appreciate that I appreciate the people that did come but you know I will never do that again so this year I'm just gonna take her to the main event and I'm not gonna have a actual party at main event I'm just gonna take her and just let her play around and have a good time and then we're gonna go to Papa Do's and we're gonna eat dinner and we're gonna have her cake and sing happy birthday and have her balloons and have her gifts and stuff like that but I'm not gonna do no party because I spent way too much money and nobody show up so I'm not doing that I'm not doing it again and that was one of the main reasons why I was taking her to Walt Disney World so she can enjoy her birthday but we're gonna be doing that for spring break so that's that will be our vacation Walt Disney World for spring break so I'm just gonna take her to main event I'm gonna take her to Papa Do's I'm gonna go get her gifts and stuff so basically I'm just gonna do a big um prepare with me for Mimi's birthday I'm gonna take you all to get her cake done I'm gonna take you all to um get her gifts I need to find her outfit I need to get her some shoes so it's a lot of things that I need to get for her I'm probably gonna take her to get her feet done as well so all of those things will be in that vlog but yeah y'all just kind of want to give y'all like that little update um i'm kind of sad about it because i kind of wanted to go get on a plane and get out of houston but you know it's all good that will be something that we can do for spring break because she'll be out a whole week and then 
yeah i mean i can give y'all many balls out there so um yeah we're gonna have a good time so i cannot wait for that but um yeah y'all so i'm about to go ahead and leave because i need to go to the bank and then i need to go to the post office to get this p.o box and stuff and it's already 153 and i'm talking too much the video is 11 minutes but anyway i just want to come and introduce the vlog and say hey girl hey but let's go ahead and get on get on into this vlog y'all oh,